Hello everyone. This video is going to be about, pardon me, my stove saga. I call it the saga, yes, because it was. Now, I started about two months prior to call maintenance, contact them, ask for my, sto my stove to be repaired. The burners worked, the oven did not. It wouldn't register the temperature and it became a very big fire hazard. I was told by maintenance someone would be contacting me in within 72 hours that they that to make the appointment to come and look at it I waited about a week to, no almost two weeks called to ask what's the status only to be told that no maintenance request order maintenance order had been put in none from my unit and I went oh can I put one in you have a microwave and you have a toaster oven so due to COVID we don't have to come in and fix your stove or oven right now and I had to inform them that the stove or oven is just like if the fridge or my hydro or my heat wasn't working in the winter. They have an obligation, COVID or not, to fix it. So then I was told within 48 hours, someone would be in touch with me. I waited almost 72 hours contacted them again now that's the second time and said what's the status of the work order for my oven mm, there is none and yet they asked me the questions do you have a fever do you have all this stuff but there was no work order again. So I went through those questions again. I put in an, I, uh, they said they put in a work order. Then about th week, week and a half later, which is close to two months around the, or close to two months, because it actually did take a little longer than two months. There was a fire in my building that was really, really scary. It was something that was plugged in, caused it. I contacted this time my building manager, went up higher than maintenance. She said, no work order was put in, none, silch. That's three times I was lied to. And by this point, I was losing it on on my building manager the poor woman must have been floored I wasn't rude or anything like that I wasn't threatening don't get me wrong and she said let me put it put in a request not even 24 hours after she put in the request stating that they had to get my, come in and check my oven ASAP I got a phone call. They were gonna that they were coming in. I'm like, okay, awesome. Then they came in and the person that came in said it's either the thing that regulates and says what temperature it is or it's the computer brain in the where the timepiece was and then I said okay so 
then I waited for, I think it was about 24 to 48 hours. Or, no, 24 or less. And a professional oven person came from the, the people that do the, the ovens from that particular company. And they said it was the computerized brain piece and that I wouldn't likely see them again. Then the following week on the Tuesday, my building manager came and measured the area for the stove so that she could make sure that she got the right one because it was suggested to get a new stove that it had to be replaced because the computer brain would be really hard to and more expensive to replace so I said okay and that I was told that it would likely be the following either Tuesday or Thursday so I thought I had time I am sitting there on the Thursday morning this is about two weeks ago now and all of a sudden it's not even eight it's around 8 30 in the morning people 8 30 in the morning rap, 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 at the door and I'm like just a minute I go to the door and it's one of my building attendants the guys are here with your new stove oh okay let me take what I've got on the burner off and let me empty the drawer real quick because I was not expecting this till next week and then they switched them out they used my new one to finish cooking my eggs and sent a message to my building manager who was pleasantly surprised that it came and it came that quick I think they were just really floored and knew once it went above at, that they needed to get this done. So yeah, I have a brand new oven, at, well brand new stove, and I had to get a friend come over and help me put the back part on that sits on the back it wasn't on it and they the people the men that delivered it had no idea how to put it on so I wasn't waiting for maintenance again and they still haven't contacted me about putting that on so yeah good thing my friend gave but it only it's only got the time piece on it and that so not a big deal anyhow and it turns out it's the exact same stove that after years and years of my neighbor having is giving her trouble but she has the exact same stove that I just got so yeah that's the saga of my stove peace much love bye for now